So in today's video, if there's a chance that you don't know already, there are new Blood Moon skins on the PvE. As you know, every year Blood Moon skins come out, but this particular year, it seems to be kind of hyped up because there is A, a new Jin skin, which people have been wanting a new Jin skin since he came out, to be honest. They just want him to get a bunch of skins because they like him as a character, that's fine. But also this Blood Moon Diana, which is actually, in my opinion, I think it's pretty cool. Some people are like, that's a skin that everybody can see coming from a mile away. In my opinion, yeah, sure, but it still looks cool. The splash art is out, and I have images of these skins, as well as some of the splash arts as I do this video. One of the ones I'm actually kind of excited for is Blood Moon Twisted Fate. I don't have a skin for Twisted Fate, and I was waiting to get one until I saw something cool. This might be it. It looks fantastic, in my opinion. There's also a Blood Moon skin for Talon, by the way, as well. But one of the other things I want to mention in this video is there's something called Assassin Mode, assets for it, on the PvE. And this is just my theory craft opinion of what that possibly could be. Because it looks like from these assets that it's some sort of score base, maybe even a, I don't want to say arena, but maybe it's about who can get the most amount of points through kills and other means first, more so than pushing towers and destroying a nexus. So kind of like Dominion, or not Dominion, my bad, probably like more like Ascension, maybe even Dominion you could say, where it's kind of about, you know, points that scale up, but maybe it's more set in kills this time instead of certain objectives. So instead of Ascension, as in you would capture relics to get points, maybe in Assassin mode it's just all about assassinating the enemy team, just taking them out. Maybe also in the teaser for the Blood Moon skins, it looks like there's a Blood Moon themed Rift. This also has something to do with the game mode, in which case they practiced doing a Rift skin with the Winter Rift, and now they're going to do like an Assassin Blood Moon skin for this new mode. It should be cool to see all in all, but without this video I have pictures about it. I will also link the Surrender at 20 post in the description below, so feel free to check that out as well. But that's all for this video, that's all the information I have, and if there is more information that comes out, I'll be sure to probably make another video about it. So thank you for watching this video if you watched this far. Feel free to like, comment, and subscribe if you so feel the must the need to as well. But I don't know which video will be next, because life can be quite a mess. So until next time, take care from the Fire Good Eye FS.